Hi guys! I'm so happy today because I'm making a video again. <laughs> so this video is going to be about boys. I want to explain how this all started, okay? So I have been using dating apps for the last few years. In the beginning, I didn't know what kind of man I want. I didn't know exactly what I liked, what I didn't like. There were some things that I thought maybe that I can get over it, maybe I can, you know, deal with it. And then I realized, no, that's something that I don't accept at all. That's something that I don't like and I don't want. So meeting a lot of people helped me realize a lot of things. But there are just so many guys. <laughs> there are just so many. So many on these apps and I it's just am I gonna go through every single person that's gonna take forever I'm gonna be single forever so <laughs> so I thought what is the best way to know that this is a person that will be worth my time at least will be worth that I actually get in a car and go meet this person and spend an hour or two to get to know them so i figured that i should ask the questions ask them the question important questions at least at least it will give me an idea so some people have already disagreed with me and they said oh you can never know like you have to meet the person and i agree i agree but Oh my god, if you use dating apps, you will see that, that there are so many kind of guys on, on these apps and unbelievable things that they say. So I'm going to show you, give you the proof that these guys, you know, asking the right questions, it really helps. It helps eliminate those guys that I don't need to interact with them sometimes I would match with someone and then we would talk and talk and then at the end he tells me he's just looking for a hookup I'm like oh my god I spent this whole time talking to you why did I waste all this time and what is worse is actually me going there and meeting this person spending this whole like hour or maybe even dates maybe I go on one two three dates in the end they tell me Actually, I'm really not looking for anything serious and I'm like... So, I thought I have to be smart here. I can't keep wasting my time like this. I have to figure out a way. Now I immediately ask the person, what are you looking for? Before anything, I know maybe some guys will be like... Oh, this is like too much, too much straightforwardness and I can't handle it. <laughs> <laughs> some guys will be, you know, scared by this but I don't care. If that scares the guy, then I don't need this guy. And I've had, actually, I've had guys ask me this question. What are you looking for? Ah. <laughs> so when a guy asks me this question, I really feel so happy. So I'm just going to show you some of the responses that I got to this question. And I'm gonna show it on screen. Okay, so this one. I asked him what are you looking for in this app and he says something genuine what about you but I'm open-minded I suppose hmm. I am open-minded I suppose that I'm open-minded maybe I am not open-minded though so I don't know it depends what about you are you looking for something? are you open-minded or closed-minded because it depends on if you're open-minded I'm gonna be open-minded if you're closed-minded I'm gonna be closed-minded what? I was like, you suppose? So you're looking for something genuine, but you're open-minded to something that is not genuine. <laughs> so you can tell, you can tell really focus, girls. <laughs> focus on their answer. Look at what he's saying. He's saying something genuine. That's all he said. He doesn't even want to talk about it. He doesn't want to describe or give you more detail. No, just something genuine. But I'm open-minded, I suppose. 
I suppose, I guess, I think, if, when they use these words, that means that they're hesitant. And you don't want a hesitant person who's gonna be like, oh yeah, I want something serious, uh, I think. And then after a few days, you'll be like, oh, actually, I changed my mind. You don't want that, okay? Because you're not here to waste your time. And so I told him that and he said, preferably a relationship. Look at the words, preferably. That's the word that he used. So he prefers it would be a relationship, but he's okay if you just want to have Maybe some other girl would be okay with that. But I, on the other hand, I'm not like that, okay? So I want something serious. I will not accept anything less than that. Here's another response that I got. Um, what are you looking for? And he said, attraction, chemistry, good conversation. Give me your own original answer, please. What he said is exactly what I said on my profile. And he just used my answer. So he really didn't put any effort into thinking what what he really actually wants he's just saying whatever he's sweet talking to me this is a way of manipulation some guys do that they sweet talk you they will tell you all the things that you like just so they can get you to do what he wants in the end where's your personality where's your originality I'm, I want to see who you are I want to get to know who you are I don't want a copy of me, I don't want someone just copying me, I want someone that I can grow with. And here's another response, he wants something casual and fun, he just recently out of something, he can't even say relationship, recently out of something? Just say that you just recently were out of a relationship, he can't even say the word relationship, if he can't say that word, that's really not a good sign i told him there are so many girls and you can pay them too <laughs> oh guys anyway let's see what else did i get so here's a guy actually he was a really cute guy he was extremely handsome and he said honestly just a hookup so it seems like we're not looking for the same thing thank you for being honest bye unfortunately all that cuteness and he's honest so that's good you know that's a good thing if that's what you want then at least be honest don't trick people into thinking that you're in the same page as them and then eventually they have to figure it out or you tell them in a way or something and you just waste both of your time and especially my time <laughs> really god and I've had a guy like this, I have met this guy, and he kept telling me all oh, the sweetest things. Maybe he thought that, oh, on the third date, she's gonna do this for me. Some guys, they think, you know, uh, that after three dates or five dates, some guys will wait, will wait, and keep pretending. They just lead you on. And it's your job, it's your job to notice these things. You have to be careful, girl. <laughs> I have learned, oh my god, I have learned that learned so much. <laughs> I know if you're single and you really want love in your life, if you're like me, you really want love so badly that sometimes you just become blind and you're like, you overlook things and you're like, oh, it's fine. No, no, it's not fine. Be strong, you have to be strong. So there's another response. What are you looking for? I don't really know yet. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just like, ha 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 very funny that's amazing you make a profile but you don't know why <laughs> a lot of guys would tell me i don't know i'm not sure yet who knows we'll see no 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 you either want something serious or you don't want something serious it's simple really you're smart enough to know what you want so this guy asked him what are you looking for and he just said hey and then I asked him again what are you looking for? Nothing. He couldn't even he couldn't even answer. So if he doesn't answer, that's good. Thank you so much. Because this way I can just delete and I can move on. Good way to eliminate these guys. He can't even answer the question. I don't want a guy who can't even answer a question. I want a man who is a real man who is able to own it and say, I want a relationship. And you know, he's proud of it, he's not ashamed of it, and he will say, that's what I want. Just own it. Or like that guy who was just like, 
you know, honestly, I just want a hookup. So at least he was honest about it. You know, honest. Don't be like, oh, I'm not sure. I don't know. Just say what you want. This is another example. This guy, he was like, uh, I want someone to have fun with, go to the beach, hike, go on adventures, someone to chill with, watch them shows while we cuddle. And it just gives you all this image that, oh, it's so nice and so romantic. He must want something serious. That's what you think. And that's what he wants you to think. And then if I didn't ask him again, I wouldn't have known. I would have thought that he just wants something serious. But no, don't be fooled. <laughs> I asked him again, does that mean you want serious or casual? And then he said, something casual right now. I said, good luck. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> it's either that he wants something serious he's not, and he's scared that that would scare me. So he's changing his answer. He is still not giving me a real answer to what he feels. And that's not something that I want in a man. If he's already scared to tell me what he really wants, right from the beginning about a simple question, like, you're scared to say that? That's a problem. Here's another example. This guy, he was like, um, not looking for anything. Uh, want anything serious at the moment just good company and good time suppose you could call it a fling suppose again with the suppose so another guy to eliminate I don't do casual fling I don't do that okay I save myself for something someone who's worth it because come on <laughs> I know my worth. So these kind of guys, they just want good company. Like he said, he just wants someone. These guys are lonely. And they want just someone to fill in the time, their need, just for in the meantime. And then later, he will, when he actually meets the one, then he will leave you for her. And you don't want to be that person, do you? If you'd want, then okay. But that's not me. I don't want to be that person. I mean, you, you're using me as a distraction or just, you know, I'm not, I'm not that for you. I have met a guy who told me, who told me that he wants something serious, the real thing. And then he rarely asked me anything. He didn't care about who I am, what I think, what I want out of life. I was the only one asking him questions and getting to know him, what he liked, what he wants, dreams, his childhood everything but he barely asked me anything and that's another sign that he's not serious his mind is not there <laughs> the only thing he's wanting is one thing and he just keeps waiting for that so if a guy he says just casual just something like no i know what it means casual just having fun that's someone who's not ready to really get to know who you are no i want someone who's ready to connect to really go deep with our emotions and grow together <laughs> one day one day <laughs> i think that's it is there anything else there's so much actually there's so many stories i have so many stories if you want more of these videos if you have any questions anything that you want to know about this just let me know in the comments and i would love to answer you <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. And yeah, I have a Patreon. Uh, if you want to join, the links are in the description. I have so many new pictures on my Instagram, by the way. You have to go and check it out. <laughs> okay, bye. There's no one